Nice. We're live. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Chicho. And we're doing an uns unscheduled live stream comic book haul. I just got a package uh, delivered to me late yesterday. And uh, I want to crack this baby open ASAP. Uh, I've been waiting for this thing to come. Uh, we ended up buying a couple of weeks ago and it took a while for it to, to get here uh, 10 days ago a couple of weeks ago I guess so I was tracking it tracking it tracking it, and finally got the notification that it arrived so I went and picked it up um, and this is a comic book uh, that I've been tracking it's a comic book series I've been tracking for a while and uh, I was waiting uh, to be able to get my hands on it um, at a good deal right I was able to I could have picked up issue number one of this uh, a graded issue number one of this at 9.6 for at the time it was fair fair price it was it's heavy it was like 190 dollars or something like this but i didn't pick up issue number one i don't have issue number one elder god <laughs> i'm gonna wait like five minutes for people to roll in i sent out the notifications in uh on discord and uh Twitter gabs, my Patreon page and stuff like this. Um, and uh, just figured, Ripper, how are you doing? Good evening. I, I told Ripper earlier on, he sent me a message. So I let him know that uh, I had a comic book haul possibly doing it today. And I finally, I was able to get it in today. Awesome, awesome. Reno Mike, how are you doing? Long time no see, long time no see. Check it out, check it out. <laughs> awesome. Lions, lions, how are you doing? I had some bad news. Oh, what was the bad news, brother? What was the bad news? Are you guys shutting down again in the UK? Let's go. <laughs> liquor liquor stream void. Um, seriously, the berries we're getting this year are absolutely amazing. So the odds are we got three streams coming up. One Saturday, Sunday, and then Monday. Uh, once we do these three streams, the odds are in the next set, we're going to do a um, liqueur stream. Okay. I need to uh, do another lemon and I'm going to try to get some strawberries going and some other liqueurs. Catholic traditionalist, how are you doing? Graham, hello. Thanks for understanding my weird schedule. No worries, Graham. Weird schedule, dude. My schedule, I think I'm one of the few people on Twitch streaming that hasn't set a set schedule. I announced them, right? Which I should. I'm going to try to this summer to set two days set schedule because from what i've been told you need a set schedule to be able to get your numbers up so you can go into partnership mode and stuff like this but i'm on i go with my partner's schedule right she's shift work so i do shift work my best friend's dad oh dude your best friend's dad died was it accidental or was it expected or was it self-inflicted Rest in peace, best wishes. Yeah, lions. <clears throat> I hope it was, uh, it's weird to say, but I hope it was expected because that way it's not, you know, people were able to close chapters uh, that they needed to, right? Expected kind of cancer. Okay, that's the sort of the best case situation when someone's departing. If it was accidental, then people have a lot of regrets. They, didn't, they weren't able to say their final words and, it's unexpected it's shock and if it was self-inflicted that's uh, that's huge man huge huge send your friend uh, our best wishes send your friend our best wishes catholic traditions waiting for my daughter's last dance of the day she's dancing in the big showcase showcase wow been a brutally long week being a dance dad is tough oh man being a dad is tough catholic traditions i can't even imagine how you guys do it vc how are you doing good luck to her and awesome i will okay elder god ah sorry to hear i hope he was elderly like it's weird the uh, there should be some kind of math some kind of graph system where the shock factor or the loss to a family or society is i'm pretty sure there is actuaries do that 74 that's a good life man 74 man if i make it to 74 if i can still dance i'll be dancing right hopefully we all this is something that armenians saying they say uh 
It means, I hope your, your hair goes white, right? This is something that the elders say to the young people, saying that uh, we hope your hair goes white. And the young people n never really understand. Basically, that means we, they hope that you live a ripe old age. And another thing that we say, uh, we wish people if, you know, it comes up every now and then where you say, uh, we hope you pass away in your sleep. When you're sleeping, you you sleep and you don't wake up the next day. Hopefully, you're really old when that happens, right? Lark, doing well, doing well, doing well. Dancing in the DJ Loblova stream was good. Gold, yeah, yeah, I ripper. That was fantastic. Too bad about Twitch bringing in these new copyright stuff with music. We planned on doing more, but that's off the books now, right? VC lost my grandfather to COVID last month. Oh, dude, he was very old and had already survived many diseases. It was very hard, but it was a peaceful end. Okay, okay, I'm glad it was a peaceful end, for sure. These are these are heavy, heavy, heavy newses, gang. Should we cheer cheer things up a little bit with a little comic book thing? Should we do this? Should we do this? No, yeah. Yeah, you see, grandfather, I have one grandmother left, as you know, and uh, uh, I'll be very sad. Uh, I hope she passes before we do, because that's what elders need, want to happen, right? The older generation should never have to bury a younger generation. If, if there was anything to uh, the way life, society, existence should be, uh, parents should never have to bury their children right um and grandparents their their children or grandchildren and stuff like this so yeah let's cheer up thanks guys our pleasure we see our pleasure should we do should we do should we do all my grandparents are gone now to comics now to comics let's do let's do let me tell you what this is. Well, no, I'm going to show you what this is. I'm going to give you the prices first. Okay, let me bring this up. Okay, gang. So this is a run. Issue number 21 to 22. I ended up paying, it cost me on the auction, it cost me $81 Canadian. Uh, my bidding auction was $81 Canadian, which is like $60 US. Okay, so there's 21 issues here. And it's a run from number two to number 22 cost me $60 US shipping was $20 Canadian right so it comes out to about $15 US so total price tag on this and there was like you know four dollar five dollar tax or something right so total price on this including shipping was around 75 78 dollars US came out to about $105 Canadian okay huge thank you to philip and connor for sending funds in for us to do a comic book haul because as you know we did the comic book reading of uh, mad number two so the funds that came in from philip and connor thank you very much gang we ended up buying mad number two right and we did the reading for mad number two and there was a little bit left over so i topped it up to be able to get this okay I had to do it and this is something I've been tracking for a while I've been trying to get my hands on it okay I've been trying to get a good deal on it okay that's because I, I can only afford to buy so much and I try to get good deals right I was trying to get a good deal on this and this is a pretty good deal basically it ended up costing around five dollars Canadian per comic okay which is around 370 us per comic which is basically cover price we paid each here i don't have the number one of this i've been tracking it i wish i bought it a year ago a year and a half ago when i saw it in a comic book store where i go pick up my pull list but it was expensive it was a cgc graded copy of it it was 9.6 graded and was selling for 100 eighty dollars hundred and ninety dollars and i didn't pull the trigger and i didn't buy it pull the trigger i didn't buy it off the comic book store i was still trying to track things get a good deal and that's what happens sometimes the deals uh go away right <laughs> you can't, but i'm happy to have number two to number 21 22 from number two to 22 we got okay who are 
uh, these uh, most excellent people <laughs> these most excellent people they are comic book lovers they are comic book lovers uh, well I won't give the names uh, if the person is here if they give the okay to give their username uh, we will Pen and, pen and teller just the box and these are um, the description said they're graded anywhere between 9 to 9.6 okay so 9 to 9.6 check it out check it out nice bubbles nice bubbles hey Jack how are you doing Whoever gave this gift to Chicho, thank you, thank you. Check this out. Check this out. Nicely packaged. Very nicely packaged. And this is from a Canadian seller. Okay. Ah, thank you, Elder God. Thank you, Elder God. Knock him out. Time him out. Let's crack this open. Hello, Miro. How are you doing? Let's check this out. I know I didn't give too much warning to people before we went live, gang. So, uh, do you have any more collections, uh, Chicho? I collect uh, sneakers myself. Yeah, I showed the uh, Lions uh, about three days ago. I showed my poster collection, and I had more posters than I thought. And that video should be up tomorrow on BitChute and YouTube. And I have uh, gaming collection that I've collected over the years. It's not, I didn't go after gaming to collect. I just kept what we got, right? And I bought some stuff along the way. Nicely packaged, nicely packaged. I've never bought from the seller before. Collection Dolma, <laughs> you won't tell us about. Dolma as we do Saturday. I gotta go shopping and get the supplies. Nice. Nice. Posters. That's awesome. Is it like movie posters or just pop culture genre? Uh, there were some movie posters there. I found a 1990 uh, Tyson Tillman and uh, 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 what was the other guy's name? Uh, poster boxing poster from 1990 okay uh, there were music posters underground independent music posters it's troll Christmas take a look take a look nice and I'm gonna start listing comics on eBay again I think elder god you're getting we're getting troll action here crazy Killing it with that sword, Ripper says. This is, um, I haven't read this comic series. Okay. I've been meaning to. It's considered to be one of the best comic book runs in, the, in modern age. <laughs> oh so sweet oh my god okay this is oh yeah this is okay so let me put these in order because i'm going to show them to you from uh the lowest number from number two up okay and let me tell you what this is let me tell you what this is let me yeah elder god Go crazy. <laughs> no, any for no prisoners today. Do we know what it is? I haven't told anyone yet. I haven't told you guys what it is. Okay, let me tell you what this is. Let me tell you what this is. This is, this is, ready for this? This is Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona 
staples. Okay. Saga. Saga, baby. I finally got my hands on Saga. I don't have number one, but I got one to 22. Oh, <laughs> snap. <laughs> All first prints. All first prints. All first prints. And we ended up getting these including shipping around $80 US. Okay. Beautiful. I haven't read this yet. I am I am going to try to get my hands on the trades, okay? And get them. It it was a good deal. Ripper. I've been tracking this. I mean, this is the best deal I could find online. And dude, it was auction and so that's number two it was auction and i was <laughs> i was i i had the highest bid at 81 and it was counting down right it was counting down it was counting down and i put another bid in higher it would put a little bit higher and i put a little bit much higher okay and no one came in so i got it for 81 canadian Right, this is number three. And they look great. They look to be in amazing shape. Okay. Nice. Yeah, the trade paperbacks for these are expensive. This is number four. Right. Let me try to get the glare out of there. The covers remind me of Goosebump series. Oh, I don't know the Goosebump series. This is number five. I don't know these characters. Fiona Staples is a beautiful artist, by the way. And Vaughn, I, Brian Vaughn, I don't know if you pronounce it Vaughn or Vaughan or what you pronounce it. Uh, he did Why the Last Man, and I've read a lot of Why the Last Man. And Why the Last Man is actually f fantastic, right? Oh, you just read the trades of your library. Very nice. Real unique art style for sure. Very nice. Look at this one. Beautiful cover, right? Beautiful crazy glares crazy glares right i got heavy into paper paper girls is fantastic after you picked it up it was just optioned and is increasing in value tremendous box oh really that's cool yeah oh yeah i saw that this cover is there's a lot of people doing uh, tributes to this cover right take a look beautiful cover Vaughn, it's Vaughn. Okay, Brian K. Vaughn. Beautiful, like a lot of tributes to this cover. So, Paper Girls has been uh, option for a movie or TV series. Look at this. Beautiful. Yeah, the covers on these things are beautiful, man insane art <laughs> so nice <laughs> look at this this is like epic i've read some stuff about it ripper the tv series uh on one of the streaming so 1 million 134 million 755 678 streaming services <laughs> let's check out the rest of them very nice check it out check it out very well packaged 
very well packaged. I'm happy with the seller. I'm just gonna, uh, before I leave the feedback, I'm gonna crack open number one, number two, and number three and stuff, just to make sure it's a uh, good grade. And then we'll leave the person a very nice feedback. How do you read these uh, without uh, uh, compromising the quality though? Um, good question. <laughs> these ones I'm gonna read with trade paper bags. <laughs> right? But I don't mind bringing the quality down. This is the only copy I have, so I'm not gonna be selling it, right? So I don't mind uh, reading books. And what I do if I'm reading an expensive book, I do exactly what I do when uh, during the comic book readings, right? I hold a, a board behind it and I sit down upright. I don't read it laying down and stuff like this, right? So if it's an expensive book, that's what I do. What comic do you has the best art? Um, oh, it really depends. It really depends. There's so many different art styles out there. Right? Like, I've mentioned this before. Bisley, I love Bisley's artwork when he goes like slain. That's phenomenal. Um, I love Quigley's artwork. Uh, the, the guy, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right. The guy who did... Uh, all-star superman with morrison uh fantastic the saga number one become an immediate uh chase book for you yeah ripper i gotta get it right the kicker is it's so expensive so i gotta see what i can do about that right <laughs> elder god <laughs> not come out <laughs> read Purse police. Yeah, I've read some of purse police. I have purse police here actually. You look like a <laughs> dude. <laughs> you must be two years old. The two year old trolls are in town. Oh they're in their product of our centralized education system. Unfortunate, unfortunate. They're gonna become cannon father. They're gonna become cannon fodder. But that's politics. We'll leave that for another day. <laughs> Who's sending trolls here? Man, school's out. School's out. I'm, I'm guessing, by the way, during the summer, there's going to be more troll action than during the school season, right? Because during the school, all these little trolls go there and get indoctrinated program. They become dinglings. <laughs> and then the summer, they're free, and they come out and they try to show their show their i don't know what they're trying to show <laughs> they're trying to show something the weak trolls anyway there are some strong trolls out there those strong trolls know what the education system oh man look at this so beautiful wow and the color scheme on these is phenomenal gang phenomenal look at this smith how are you doing those <laughs> trolls <laughs> What holes did they crawl out of? Centralized education hole. Unfortunate. Too bad they don't spend the time to learn a little mathematics and learn how to read. Saga. Twin oh, I got to put this in order. That's number 22. Let me put this in order. Hellard Goss is racking up his body count. Nice. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. So good. So good. Wow beautiful beautiful oh i gotta show you these guys i gotta show you this those were some uh level one two trolls <laughs> probably got lost on their way to their quest <laughs> mods are one tapping <laughs> props boy <laughs> hilarious <laughs> i take not pleasure in killing trolls not weak trolls they're like baby trolls 
Poor little things. Poor little things. Trolls with no life behind a safe space. Laptop and mobile phones. They're probably on their parents' mobile phone, by the way. <laughs> They're not allowed to have their own phones. <laughs> I'm living at home with mommy and daddy. <laughs> Keep it up, elder. Nice. Trolls are... These are... Yeah. These are... I don't know what these are. Beautiful covers, man. Beautiful covers. Let's put this guy here. This one's a little dark. Look at this. How do we do this so it shows up better without the glare? That's the best I can do, gang. Number 12. You could toggle setting where it only allows people to chat after they followed for 15 minutes. Oh, we can do that, Lions. Or have been watching for 15 minutes. Would do a lot to discouraging them. Oh, okay. Guys, let me know. How do I do that on Discord? Let me know how to do that on Discord and I will we'll do it. This is a beautiful cover. Look at that thing. Nice. Yeah, beautiful ripper. Nice, nice. You've read them, Burns, eh? Oh, Elder God, awesome. Do it for us. From now on, we'll do that. Those kinds of weak trolls, anyway, they don't have the attention span to hang around for 15 minutes. Very central cover. Very nice, very nice. So pleasing, so pleasing. And I love covers where, this is sort of more modern, uh, where there isn't a whole bunch of text. It's just the art, right? Valiant Comics was one of the first... Uh, companies that i know of in the 1990s that started doing this you would look on the shelves and a lot of the comics had like text balloons and which is okay but valiant stood out because of the art beautiful i don't want to take the fun away from elder blood for the blood god and all that so dude what are you doing these days electric bar by electric That's what I look like if I stayed off the hard side. <laughs> Please do not kill. Oh, look at that. <laughs> God of Thunder, Elder God. Very cool. this number 18 very cool very cool this one is phenomenal look at that Chicho TV head cover looks like the mascot for Game Fan magazine in the 1980s. Chicho, great haul so far, great haul. Very happy to have this. Number two goes for like in high grade, which this is, goes for a fair bit. He's a little devil baby or something. Number 20. What up, brother? Saucy Rossi, how are you doing? I saw comics and was summoned. <laughs> nice. Saucy, I got Saga. Number 2 to number 22. 21 comics. Including shipping and taxes and whatnot. Ended up costing like $80 US. 
all first prints. Sweet, sweet. Gonna be chasing number one now. Gotta happen. I didn't want to. Oh man, I got myself in a jam. <laughs> The cover art varies so much. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool, Alliance. And here's number 22. Beautiful. A lot of horn characters in the series. Horny books, horny books. Uh, it's for mature readers, from what I understand. Great deal, yeah. It's the best deal I could find online. Like, and I've been... I've had it on my radar for a while. In a strawberry jam, as seen on Chicho's YouTube cooking. <laughs> Fun. Very happy. Should I do a crack of number two? Let me do a crack of number two. Very nice. Here's number two. I'm just going to crack it open and take a look at it, okay? this take a look no cracks very nice look at that beautiful condition Yeah, look at this thing. Look at that. Nice book. Nice book, gang. Sharp. Very sharp corners. Very sharp corners. Oh, looks so good. I can't hold it up, gang. Oh, we, am I going to hold it up? Okay, let's do it. It's in mint condition. R literally, it's in mint condition. Like this being graded, minimum 9.4. Okay, I'm going to show you a little bit of the artwork on the inside. right awesome i can't show i can't do anymore man it's it's like it's like slippery strangely i just banked the last time when you went live made 4876 pounds you got to love that especially mint yeah it's it's dude this thing looks phenomenal look at this like here i'll give you the reflection on it like okay let's throw this in the bag fantastic buy i'm gonna look look at this uh the seller to see what else the guys got i'm gonna look to see what else they got very nice very nice Awesome. Bright colors and white panels. Love it. Love it. 
It's perfect. Saga is also an amazing read. Yeah. Yeah. It's a work of art. It's a work of art. Absolutely fantastic buy for sure. Fantastic. Fantastic deal. <laughs> I try my best, man. I try my best. Sometimes I, I don't get the good deal. Sometimes I pull the trigger too far, right? I really want it or something like this. Or I go a little bit too much or whatnot. But we've shown a lot of comic book hauls over the last few years. Uh, so I do try to do my best. Uh, and you lose a lot. You lose a lot of great deals as well. But it is what it is, right? You can't buy everything. You can't buy everything. This is the fun of it. Now we got something else to chase, right? We got Mad number one <laughs> and Saga number one to chase. We'll see what we can do about it. We'll see what we can do about it. Fantastic. I just wanted to share that with you guys, gang. I knew you'd get a kick out of it. And I've been meaning, I've been telling you guys, Saga has been on my radar for a while now. People have been recommending it. I know it's a great read. I've seen some pages, some panels, and Fiona Staples. I'm like, oh, I... Uh, Brian K. Vaughn, Vaughn, a phenomenal writer. Like, you can't beat it, right? I just didn't hop on it right away. Yeah, you have an amazing collection of comic books. I got some. I got some good stuff that I've been. It's thirty plus years, right? Uh, what I miss, Zare, Zare. You missed? Wait, 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 wait. I ended up picking up saga number two number two number two two full run first prints to 22 <laughs> we just looked at all the covers saga 2 to 22 and it ended up including shipping ended up costing like around 80 dollars us all right so about 360 370 a pop and we just cracked open number two and it's a phenomenal shape beautiful comic beautiful comic right we did well we did well ripper chicho i'm excited you're going to put some books on ebay i'll be uploading a few hundred books myself on ebay this weekend i have you saved and we'll check out your stuff uh, ripper send me your ebay page thingamajiggy Oh man, Saga is such a great, <laughs> great book series. <laughs> Those Saga books look beautiful. They're beautiful. They're beautiful. Phenomenal. Very happy. I've wanted to get my hands on a set. I just have to chase number one now. Oof. Better start putting the funds away in PayPal, man. Just build it up, build it up. If you get a good deal, pull the trigger. Silent R in this Saraga. Saraga might be a british thing though is this saga sarga saga saga <laughs> awesome gang uh just a quick stream just a quick stream and by the way i'm going through the comic book boxes elder god i'm trying to find my batman cult so we can have it as one of the options to read for sunday i can't find it i've gone through five boxes now six six seven boxes and it, i can't find it i'm trying to find my batman's but it's not there i'll keep on looking it's it's there somewhere it's got to be there somewhere i know it's there somewhere right sarga ripper is it pronounced sarga no saga saga for sure elder god took it too far <laughs> I'm confusing with Saga, Saga Genius. Lava, lava. Ch -ch -ch. That is so cool, man. Padre! Yes. By the way, Padre, at the beginning of the stream, I said uh, thank you very, very much to Connor and Philip for sending in the funds. I just topped it up a little bit to be able to get this one. Padre? Padre, Padre, Padre. Padre was one of the people that sent the funds in, by the way, gang. So thank you, Padre. Appreciate it. Don't you dare call me two-year-old again. <laughs> well, you might be you might be older, brother, but your mentality is just two. Like I call it the way the way it is, man. I I don't speak. I don't I don't talk shit too much, right? I don't. Uh, I don't. I try not to. Well, I do exaggerate a little bit. Your mentality might be one and a half. 
all four issues of cult i can send for a read if you need ah river thing i do have a man somewhere i and i put him close to me right so in one of the boxes but because i've moved around a lot of boxes all of a sudden i forgot which box they were in i'll track it down in uk it is saga as in a long story or event saga i think it's a long story uh from what i've read uh people talking about this this is epic and it's on the same level as like a star wars thing right same level as like a star wars so i think it's supposed to be saga like a grand epic story right most beautiful favorite batman yeah the cult is phenomenal and writes and right so you can't beat that i love cute girls toys toys how are you doing you're here to play nice yeah the funds were uh, spent very well this was an awesome find padre thank you right i topped it off a little bit so between all three of us uh connor padre and me we we got mad number two and a run of saga from number two to 22. man we did well six to zero from each rolls <laughs> nice <laughs> padre thank you represent padre thank you for the, the contributing and assisting in this awesome stream awesome fun little stream and it sounded like people needed a little uh pick her upper right a couple of bad news at the beginning uh so i hope it went well i hope uh this brought a little joy little fun little distraction uh sort of beautiful hall yeah love your streams awesome lark awesome gang we'll sign off thanks for popping in speedy gonzalez style okay padre 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 thank you very much for the contributions of funds connor if you end up watching this and i'm pretty sure you will because you're watching all the comic book videos thank you for sending in the funds thank you for being here gang and thank you brian k vaughn and fiona uh staples for creating such an amazing series that everyone raves about that people say is a must read right to contribute to the comic book community to lift us up right show what we're all about which is about amazing amazing storytelling and just exploration of human imagination right an amazing medium this is such a great community till next time buddy till next time gang thanks for the unscheduled my pleasure elder god and elder god salute 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 thank you you were slain mad today you were slain mad today they were little kids but man little kids step in the wrong place <laughs> they need to learn <laughs> have a great night chat have a have a great night have a great night everyone do you ever play chess i do i do we have a chess video out there do a chicho chess video you'll find that bye everyone